Hello, great people. Chef Green here. So today I am going to share with you what I'm cooking for dinner. It's a spur of the moment thing. I got to start somewhere, get back in, in the game here. So uh, let's get started. The first thing we're going to season with, I layer season all my meats I always have. First thing I've already, I stopped. I, I seasoned with the accent. And now we're going to go in with the salt. onion powder some garlic powder and this is an equivalent to the complete seasoning that a lot of people use and I'm going to do the other side and we'll come back when we're ready to cook my dilemma is whether or not I should just pan them or add some flour. So I think I kind of decided to do, well, I knew I decided to do the flour. Just want to dust them a little bit so they'll have uh, somewhat of a coating on them. So I started to brown some butter because all that I have is this country crop butter. And a half a box of these uh, peanut pasta noodles. Well, peanut pasta. Y'all, if my lighting is horrible, please forgive me. But we're going to go ahead and start layering. I'm sorry, laying these down in here. In that butter. So when I dust them like that, I only dust one side at a time. Y'all, if my lighting is horrible, please forgive me. <laughs> we turn those over and now I'm adding this to the empty space. Got a nice brown coloring on there. So we're still cooking. What we don't want to do is burn them, but we don't we do want them to be done. Um the, the proper temperature for a chicken. It's 165 degrees. So, if you're one of those people that like to test your temperatures, that's what you're looking for. Um, in terms of um, checking for doneness, you can, you know, kind of poke it or whatever to figure it out. But I'm just eyeballing it. And I'll let you know, like, how long it took me to cook. Thank you. Here's what I had not shared with you guys. I have my spray bottle of um, olive oil and I've been kind of adding it in when my pan gets dry. I put a little butter down and then I add a little olive oil to help it stay greased, the, the skillet to stay greased. So, so I, I'm down to my last chicken breast and I'm going to go ahead and Add in my onion to start sauteing them. Yes, and I'm sauteing the onions with all this fund in the bottom of the pan. F O N D, fund. That's gonna make it real good. That's where all the flavor is. Okay, now we're gonna make us a roux. Spice some more oil in there. I already put butter in the onion.
let that flour incorporate with the onions really good and then we'll move on boiling my pasta i've already added salt a couple of sprays of olive oil In they go. So, <clears throat> excuse me, I, um, cook those chicken breasts like 10 to 12 minutes each side. Make sure they were done. I'll say it, some of them were thinner than others because I actually sliced them up. And so, uh, some ended up being thinner than others. So it didn't take quite, but I'll say from eight to 12 minutes each side. It was a whole chicken breast that I split in half. Uh, since I paused, I've been just stirring. Trying to get it to a desired thickness and amount that I'm, you know, because I am adding to this pasta and the chicken. So I tasted this and it tastes like onion water. I'm adding some garlic powder and sea salt. An accent to that. Okay, now that tastes better. Now, uh, what I did not tell y'all is the idea that I had to add this condensed uh, cream of mushroom soup to it. Now, if I do that, y'all cannot say nothing. Don't say nothing to nobody in my house. Don't don't tell nobody. Just don't tell them. Cause they don't like mushrooms, but just you know, keep that between us. Here's what it, what it looks like. Let's throw that in. Get it mixed in there good so I got my little whisk. My little small whisk. Mm, let me taste that. Good Lord have mercy. Alright, we're finna add our chicken and pasta. Now let's give it a good mix. Oops. I ain't got no pasta to move. It's only half a box. Y'all going on and make y'all some of this or some variation of it. And let me know how it turned out. Charles. I'm just playing, Miss Nutt. I'm just playing. I'm just playing. I'm just playing. 